I just passed my CDL road test and I just got my uh, haircut by the homeboy Shad up here at Exquisite Cuts on Eureka Road in Taylor, Michigan. If you ever get a chance, come on, holler at the fellas at uh, Exquisite Cuts up here on Eureka. They've been uh, buying CDs for me for a minute. So, the question now is, what's next, what's next, what's in XET? I'm walking out of the Secretary of State office in uh, Taylor, Michigan, because I passed my CDL road test yesterday, and now I am a Class A CDL driver. So I had to come take my new license picture, I got a book in my nose. And now I got to go to the school uh, to take my graduation picture. And I will be done as a student. Well, it's, it's official now. I'm done as a student truck driver. So now I'm about to publish the video blog that I haven't published. I ain't published a video blog on my YouTube channel in a couple of months because I've been so busy in this truck driving school. But now I'm about to publish this bad boy. Hey, Miss E. What's going on? Absolutely everything beautiful, wonderful, wonderful. I just left the secretary of state. They told me to come back and holler at y'all to check bounce. Mm -hmm. uh -uh, I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> <We're through. laughs> I don't know. I'm not scared of Chuck. Chucky is the easiest villain. All you got to do is just kick it. I don't see how people can be scared of Chuck. I don't like any of those shows like, where you have to wait for something to jump out. Uh-huh. I still like this one. Watch TV. I get it. I all the time. I get it. Four hours a day. But I do this the whole time. I get it. If something's gonna jump out, I am done. Alright, so first hold on, let me get me a selfie here. Let me see this bad boy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. There we go. Now we can get uh the school yeah. selfie here. And I'm, here. I'm, I'm filming for my vlog, man. So uh can we get a quick little Fuck you, me! <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think I'm gonna take one last shit before I get about this motherfucker. Yeah. This is the second CD that I just sold. The gentleman over here in this white car just bought the first one. This gentleman just bought the second one. This is the second copy of the album that I've sold since obtaining the CDL. Thank you for helping an up and coming truck driver, sir. I greatly appreciate you. You're welcome, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, I found that the toilet paper was properly mounted and secure. The toilet was not cracked, damaged, or leaking. <laughs> You're not a truck driver school is tantamount to being paroled. You there for however many weeks you there. You're not getting paid depending on what company you with. I tried to get in with uh, Pam Transportation but due to the fact that I was late renewing my license last year because my my mother-in-law just died and so we had other shit to take care of besides a fucking driver's license. But it reflected that I didn't have a perfect driving record because I didn't get my license, which expired last year, renewed on my birthday. So it wasn't a ticket or a suspension. It was just that I didn't get it renewed on my birthday. And during that time, my mother-in-law was going through her final stages of cancer. So we had other shit to do. So I couldn't go through with Pam to get paid. So I had to go through with the uh, Michigan Works Program. And the state of Michigan has paid for, for the funding for me to get this expensive ass uh, $7,000 t-shirt. Thank you very much, state of Michigan. And now I'm about to get ready to head to Amazon and uh, see what's going on out there. I walked into the recruiting office here to see what was going on. All right. If they could help me get a job driving one of here. these uh, semi tractor trailers. They weren't very helpful with their information because Amazon doesn't directly hire their drivers. Amazon drivers are third party. So I'm going to stalk me a driver and see if I can get some information before security kicks me out of this bitch. And I also got a connect that I could go holler at over at the Amazon Fulfillment Center in uh, Hazel Park. So if shit don't work out here, I'm going to mind about the Hazel Park. So let me see here. I don't see any drivers out. 
Don't see anybody out I can holler at. And this motherfucker is pretty secure, pretty well secure, pretty fenced in, pretty good. So, yep, and there goes security. Let me go ahead and get the fuck up out of here. All right, so I came back to my old place of employment, the Amazon Fulfillment Center up here in Hazel Park. You know what? I'm just glad to not be in truck driver school at this very moment. That's all. I'll go anywhere except for goddamn Romulus right now. That's all. So I got a few hookups here. So I'm going to go in here and see what I can dig up. What's good, baby? I can't come here. I can't come on the uh, floor. I ain't got no vest. You cool? All right, bet. You remember what I said when I got up out of here? Next time I come back, I'm going to come back in one of them trucks, right? Mm -hmm. Today I got my CDL. Oh, that's what's up. So look, this is what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to see who are the drivers around here. Now I know Amazon don't hire their drivers directly. So I got to find out who that's some of the companies. Truck drivers? And this thing called the time team. The time team. And they only do local. 20 days, but they only get paid 20 dollars an hour. I work with it. But, uh, and, but see, I wish I would have known then if I would have told you that they would have paid their cheap. Well, I, that's already paid for. Oh, yep, look up Amazon Time. They, uh, it's all local. The furthest they've seen, it's like last. That's perfect. I can still get back here and sell CDs. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So I can see, I can, it's just like I was in the van, but I ain't got to hop out that bitch uh, 200 times and a day. All, and all you're doing, you doing, drop and hook. Touch it. Exactly. Touch it drop a hook. Yep. Uh, Y'all take care of all that yep. for us. Yep. Yep. Appreciate you, baby. Time, hey, if you see Mich uh, Michelle, I'm going to try and catch you at the hotel, but if you see Michelle, tell her I said what's up, all right? I got Indeed, baby. Yeah. Yep, so uh, I do got hookups. Amazon Time Team. I'm going to be on the lookout for that. What up, though? And I got the old lady filling out applications right now. Now, my DSP used to be right here. Right there. But they ain't here no more. At least I got me a chance to come to the Bishop Market today in Hamtramck. Now, I've been going to Dearborn, but Hamtramck is my favorite. But they out of most of the stuff. So... The next move is to find some decent work. I got the old lady at the crib researching uh, that uh, time, whatever thing it is that the homeboy just gave me the info on. Plus, I got her looking up a couple of companies here in Detroit. Will I go regional? Will I do local? I'm not sure. But something will get done because I don't want to have to sell CDs for funds. I'd rather sell them for fun. But tomorrow, I'm going to have to get out here and sell them for funds because I got two credit cards that are due. And that shit is going to get paid. But never worry. You ain't got to worry about me. As long as I can flip a disc, I don't miss a meal. So everything's going to be all right. Uh, I'm thinking about starting a trucking channel. I'm going to call it. I'm thinking Hooligan Express American Trucking. Heat. I'm thinking about that. But I'll keep you abreast of the journey. Until next time, your friendly neighborhood rap dealer, Joe Quan the Hooligan, signing off from Hamtramck, Michigan. Folks, how do you turn this thing off?